So who am I speaking with? Hi, I'm Leslie Stevens Huffman. And Leslie, uh, you gave a great presentation about how to break into mobile app development. I took copious notes, but I want to boil it down. Three things I absolutely must do if I want to break in. Okay. Well, first of all, you need to immerse yourself in the technology and get some hands-on experience. Uh, whether you do that by um, just going to the uh, developer communities and developing some apps on your own or offering to develop an app for your company thinking of an idea, but you've got to immerse yourself in the technology or you could go out and participate in a, a course uh, because now there's a lot more classes, but you're still going to need some samples. Uh, employers are going to want to see that you uh, have some hands-on experience. So that's number one. So number one, hands-on experience, absolutely yeah. must have it. Yeah. That's understood. Number two. Yeah. Number two. Number two is you really need to show your passion for the technology. In speaking with CIOs and IT managers, uh, they are willing to take a chance on someone who doesn't have a whole lot of experience if you really show passion and commitment for the technology. So that's number two. And the third thing you really have to do is market yourself appropriately and pick the right opportunities. Um, what you can't do anymore is really go out there and just sort of blanket the market. You've got to take a strategic approach and look at where you uh, might have some contacts and who you know and work your way into that uh, company uh, and get your first shot. Let me go over step number two again with you. I actually interviewed an Android developer and he said that is the way he got the job at Hipmunk actually. He said he expressed his love and passion for the Android development platform. How can one essentially express that passion? Well, certainly if you learn it on your own um, and you talk about how you've stayed up you know, late nights and uh, weekends and things, that's going to show passion. But the other way that you can do that is with your language um, and the way you present yourself during interviews. Kind of sit up forward in your chair, show excitement, uh, have lots of good examples, use some adjectives and things to give you a hand with your stories and your vignettes. Um, I think people judge attitude, you know, that's still one of these things that's the human human part of the hiring process that's never going to go away. And if the hiring manager gets the sense that you're really enthusiastic, um, then there's a good chance you're going to get the job. Leslie, thanks so much for your time. You're welcome.